get up. I don't have to go into school today because of winter weather, all of our classes have been cancelled so we're having a snow day. It's so weird to me that we can have winter weather in the middle of April. It's supposed to be spring but I guess that's Colorado for you. It is kind of nice though because it gives me some time to catch up on some work that I've been neglecting and some content that I've been wanting to create and film and just haven't had the time. I thought I'd bring you guys along for my day and show you kind of everything that I get up to as a Bible college student and content creator. On a not so typical day because normally I would have classes. It is now past 9 a.m. so I really have to get up and get going. I'm starting a lot later than I wanted to but it was really nice getting to sleep in so I'm gonna hop over to the gym, get a quick workout in and then get started on my day. <laughs> do list for the day and it keeps getting longer and longer and longer so I have a lot to do and my friend is coming over in about 30 minutes and we're gonna be doing some work together so yeah that's kind of what I'm up to at the moment I also really have to tackle my emails because they have gotten out of hand I just need my computer to finish updating project until pretty late last night and we we're just sitting on the floor brainstorming ideas and we we're both very present in the moment and I didn't really feel like filming it so that took up a large chunk of my day yesterday and then I just didn't really do much else after that so I wanted to continue this video today because I wanted to talk a little bit about my posting schedule and how I'm staying consistent recently I haven't exactly been that consistent on 
Instagram, TikTok, and all my social media platforms. I've been a little bit uninspired with content recently, and I recently just got my spark back, so I'm really excited about that, and I have a lot of ideas. But a lot of the time, I have all these ideas in my head, and then when it comes to actually filming and editing them, I just don't know what it is that I want to do, what I want to create, and so I've been trying out a new schedule slash planning system and i've been using notion and so i wanted to share that pretty much every day monday through friday as soon as i get back from school which is typically around 1 p.m i will make myself some lunch and then post and spend some time on the different social platforms and engage with my audience that's kind of what's been working for me at the moment sometimes i post a little bit later because i will hang around at school a little bit longer but that's kind of where i'm at at the moment and then i want to show you guys my notion and how i've been using it because it has been so so helpful so this is my notion social media calendar planner for those of you who don't know what notion is it is a planning platform that is totally free to download so if any of you are interested in it i will link it down below and check it out and i believe that this template this social media calendar template was also free with notion i just tweaked it a little bit to fit my needs and to fit more of the social media platforms that i use but i will also link this template down below if you guys are interested in it this has been so helpful so last sunday i sat down and i spent about an hour just planning out two weeks worth of content and my current schedule and plan is to post monday tuesday wednesday thursday and friday at around about the same time i don't really post on weekends if there's something that i want to post then i will but it's not the end of the world if i don't i kind of like to keep my weekends more just for fun but for the most part my aim is to post monday through friday at 1 30 pm if this is about about 10 video ideas i think i'm at just a few videos short of 10 to be completely honest but as you can see i've already posted some of them and then these are the ones that i'm still in the process of planning editing so something that i love about this specific calendar is that you can have the status of it so you can know when you're in the planning process and when it's posted i also love that you can put the platforms because sometimes for example like this post god's timing it was a post and it wasn't a video so i don't typically put posts posts on TikTok. I know that you can. I just don't. I don't know. I haven't really found that they've worked that well for me and I don't really like them. I typically only put posts on like Instagram and Lemon8 is a new platform that I have been playing around with and actually really, really loving. So if you don't have Lemon8 yet, I highly recommend getting on that. And then all of the video content that typically goes on to Instagram, TikTok, and Pinterest. So I like that I can see that. And then also I like that you can label it as like a video a carousel post you can also put whether it's a partnership or not and it's just a really really nice layout i also like that you can tick if you still need visuals so for these ones i still need to go and shoot some content and then what is also something that i love about this calendar is that you can plan your videos within this so for example i just posted this 5 a.m morning routine a few days ago and if i click open it has all of like my information that i have about the video so i have like my filming list content needed still and just the video idea i also sometimes put the caption in so for example how to become a morning person i already have the caption sort of in here i might tweak it a little bit before i actually post the video but it's already sitting in here so it's all just in one place it's all so easy and nice to see and it's really really satisfying when you change it from planning to post it this is my current social media calendar in Notion that I've been using and so far so good. I know it's only been four days that I've been using it, but so far I've managed to stay consistent and post every single day this week and I'm really happy about that because like I said, I've been so inconsistent and it's been something I've been really struggling with. So I'm really hoping that this is going to be something that sticks. Mm -hmm. 